Yo, what's going on guys? In this video, I'll be talking to you about a video that Prodigy released very close ago and very early on. And I just watched it, it's pretty insane. And basically, Prodigy is removing math. Well, they're not really removing math. They're making a version of Prodigy with zero math involved. They even made a video about it and posted it on their website. So today we'll be talking about it and showing it to you. And basically how you can get it and when it's releasing, which is super cool. It's a whole different game than Prodigy, made by the same people, but with no math. So, if you go on their website, on this area about Prodigy English, which is a apparently a new game they're making that's like Prodigy, except instead of math, it's language arts, where you talk about like language stuff like nouns and stuff and apparently you can like build stuff like minecraft and stuff and it isn't released yet but you can get early access apparently it's released in spring 2022 and they even made a video about it which we're about to watch right now let's because see you love you love us and we love you we're launching a new game yes it's true as you can see, the game is basically entirely different from Prodigy. You see the menu, there's like energy and stuff, and the characters are all different, and they'll show you that you can build on later, and it looks like it's also going to be a tablet game or a phone game or a mobile game, but it'll probably also be for computer and Windows as well. As you can see, it looks super cool, it's super clean and stuff, and we'll keep on watching now. How can a shovel, an axe, and some trees help you read and write English with great ease? It's simple. Just start playing. And in no time, we'll have you saying, a person play. As you can see, they said there will be like a shovel, an axe, and trees. So I think it's going to be like a building survival game, kind of like Minecraft, except you learn along the way. I don't know if there's going to be monsters like a project. I don't know what you're going to need to do the questions for, like what, where you need to do the questions, or if you need to do them to place a tree or cut them. Or thing is a noun. Here I go, clown, town, and gown. Announcing Prodigy English, a new sandbox game for students. As you can see, remember how we saw that energy thing at the beginning? I think you need a certain amount of energy to cut down a tree, and to get that energy, you probably need to do the questions. I think the questions are optional if you want to do energy, which is kind of cool. Prodigy English, a new sandbox game for students, teachers, and parents to discover. Build your world one English lesson at a time. And as you can see, you can play stuff and like make your own house. I feel like this building system looks way cooler than the one currently in Prodigy. Because like in the current Prodigy, to build stuff, it's like super difficult for your house. But in this one, I'm pretty sure it's also going to be multiplayer. And you can like build super cool houses and stuff. Let's get started. Sign up for early access today. Overall, Prodigy English looks super cool. I mean, if you want to play it before it releases, you could get early access. But basically, uh, it's like Prodigy, but like a whole different game and language arts. And as soon as the game comes out, I'm going to be making a video on it. It will be super cool. So yeah, that's basically it. And I'll see you guys in the next one.